Controversy over a popular new book with a sexual theme. And some local libraries are saying, no way. Shelley Walcott reports from Fond du Lac. It's the book that has everybody talking up here in Fond du Lac after it was decided that it was too erotic for the library. Here in Fond du Lac, opinions on the best-selling book, Fifty Shades of Grey, are pretty black and white. People either support the library's decision to not carry the novel, or they don't. I think it should be an individual decision. It doesn't really bother me. I don't read that type of book, so it wouldn't really affect me very much. Library director Ken Hall says the library has no plans to buy the controversial book. Hall was not available for an interview today, but he told the Fond du Lac reporter the person who orders books for the library told him, quote, we do not collect erotica and that he supports that decision. The manager of Book World in downtown Fond du Lac says Fifty Shades of Grey is flying off store shelves. There has been a big demand and part of the reason is because it was released as an e-book before it actually came out in paper print. Fifty Shades of Grey is about a couple involved in a passionate affair. The book contains scenes of sadomasochism. Some call it erotica masquerading as a romance novel. A few pages, it's pretty racy. It's pretty racy. Yep, definitely. Which is why Fond du Lac library officials aren't buying it. And McDermott says that's what bookstores like hers are there for. I think if it's a particular genre of book that they don't normally carry, then I think that that's completely their prerogative. By the way, at the nearby Ripon Library, which is only about 20 miles from here, there's about 75 people on a waiting list to read the book there. On your side, in Fond du Lac, I'm Shelley Walka, today's TMJ4. And Fond du Lac library leaders also say they might reevaluate the situation later.